For a really long time, I've been wanting to write a horror-based character, and a lot of my characters have been very wholesome and cute, but I've also wanted to work on something kind of terrifying. So when we were looking at Skarner, we were like, yes, our time has come. We're gonna write what we call Scorer, which is Skarner horror. Hi, I'm Elise Lemoyne. I'm a senior writer here at Riot Games on League of Legends, and I was the writer on Skarner's VGU. And today I'm here to talk about Skarner's lore and all the excitement that that brings for Runeterra and League of Legends. Skarner's new lore is that he is a 10,000 plus year old Brackern and is the longest serving and founding member of Ishtal's ruling caste, the Yuntal. As the longest serving member, he has been a part of Ishtal's history and has been a part of every key decision you know, leading up to the present, including the decision to sequester Ishtal from the rest of the world. He is determined to protect Ishtal at any cost. The way that he sees the world develop outside of Ishtal has just fueled this paranoia that may not be entirely reality. Skarner sees that mortals will do anything they can to grasp even a modicum of power and that their like penchants for violence is also incredibly high. He both loves humans and distrusts them, and he's hearing these whispers of you know, ending Ishtal's isolation, and that's like really driving his paranoia. What makes Skarner scary isn't just that he's giant or that he can rip through the terrain. It is this paranoia and that even the best intentions can become twisted. I hope that like people kind of engaging with Skarner's story kind of feel the kind of visceral fear that comes from uh, twisted good intentions, like what it means to be in that position and to also be on the receiving end of a character like Skarner. The reason why we updated Skarner's lore is, you know, with the goal of creating a single canon throughout all of Runeterra, uh, there leaves a lot of questions with uh, the Brackern and, and Hextech and what that means. On a personal level, working on Skarner and knowing I'm changing so much, it's a little terrifying because we want to place these champions like in our lore, we want to elevate them even higher, but we also don't want to disrespect the people who love Skarner and the reasons why they love Skarner. And so now as like, you know, the oldest member of the Yuntal, Skarner is now one of the most important characters in Ishtal, which really elevates him to a new level, but it is still different than where he used to be. I hope that like current Skarner mains enjoy the new Skarner. He's awesome. I really hope like with his story they see his new importance in Ishtal and how integral he's become to the region and how he's now like a living piece of their history. And that they think that this this new lore is worthy of the character that they're so dedicated to.